these Gucci 2016s have been in my wish list on the real real for three years. They're the loafers with the spikes. Do you think I might scare a few people off here? Oh well. We need an outfit that deserves to be paired with these babies. Time to put them together for the Christmas party. 1970s vintage palazzo pants. I promised myself I wasn't gonna buy another 70s maxi dress. But guess what? She's not a dress. To me, this is totally ungaro. Look at this sweep. I do like the idea of breaking up the print with a belt. Lately, I'm quite obsessed with Judith Lieber vintage belts. Why? Because you can make them tighter or looser from the back. Genius! The only problem is as you move, these belts tend to stretch. If you want it to stay in place, just stick a little bobby pin right in there. Then she's not going anywhere. This is fab. My hair's competing. Gotta go up. It's a good hair day. You don't want to waste it, God forbid. Let's use a little dry volume blast by Living Proof. Lift up your roots. Stick it in there, let it dry for a sec, shake upside down, and it'll give you the volume you need. Let's do an earring. I do think the Carla Rockmore Whiskey Topaz earrings add the perfect touch. I mean, the colors match seamlessly, and they're still short enough not to compete with the turtleneck neckline. Can we take a moment for the citrine and emerald green transparent enamel ring? I think we're almost ready. These shoes totally need a shoehorn. Somehow I like that. For some reason, I find it a little quaint. Do you think we should show a little restraint with the bag? The lip was too red. It needed more goth, more vamp. This one's Emily Heath, the new vamp, great color. I understand this isn't necessarily a look that everybody might put on, but I love it. And I certainly hope I don't scare anybody off because I'm quite kind. But fashion should speak to you first and foremost. Have a happy holiday. I just hope that I'm not looking more festive than her tree. Have a good night. Weather outside is frightful, but that fire is mm, delightful.